It's Uh oh. Girl, listen. She making a mess, y'all. Lose your soul, girl. Yeah, yeah, bro. Okay, me and that, you better for a mess. It's nice and dry. I heard some people say don't uh, water them before you harvest them. Mm -hmm. I, I want the ones, the ones later, but not these ones. Ugh. Okay. These roots are strong. Mm, oh, I got around. baby ones. Ooh. <laughs> they like bees. Uh oh. They look like little bees. Oh, they got a little one. This is so cool. You don't know how many potato harvesting videos That's a good sign. I've seen. Yeah, because I feel like you can wash them up, oil them up, and um, season Roast them. Put them in the air fryer or something. Or something. Or something. I'm excited. I'm excited about them, my little baby potatoes. Um, these went in the dirt. I got the number, the, I think, I don't know. I want to say the 18th or the 15th of June. So it hasn't been quite two months. And I was going to try to hold out to next week. But the more they die back, can you pan over to those over there? The more they die back, the more I'm like, hmm, I'm not sure. <laughs> this, you know, I don't want them to start well, re-sprouting or going seeing, to seed. After seeing this, you think you can give those a couple of weeks? Oh, we the one. <gasps> I rubbed the skin off. I might have to eat that one tonight. Girl, the skin off this one too. You came off with the stem. This bag had one potato in it. I just put one, one whole slip. seed potato. Oh, okay. Um, I didn't cut it. I was looking for my tags. Like these little things. They um what you call it? Mm -hmm. Rough. So um we got these itty bitty babies. So you think I should leave the other ones out here a few more days? Yeah, give them a few more days based on what you're getting today. Ooh, there's another tater. Ooh, it's be in my face. Mm -mm. You know I'm scared to get stung. I know. Being stung ain't the business. Stinging ain't the business, y'all. Get a soil sifter. Mm -mm. Girl, the ripping that skin right on off. Oh, Miss Miss <coughs> Miss Hart, uh, Marie from Homestead Hart said, "Don't be." I'm um, taking the skin off my potatoes. Be gentle. <laughs> I thought I was being gentle, man. <laughs> Let's see if I got some more. There's a lot of dirt in here, but I don't know if I got more potatoes. Quite a bit of root. But I did, um, I just kept adding soil to the potatoes. But as I was watching people, I feel like they grow bigger when you, all your soils is, is in here at once. 
So I got a question because you know I'm <laughs> learning too. Um, if you leave like those little itty bitty ones, if you were to leave them in there, would they go to seed and grow more potatoes? Or? That's what somebody said. They said I'm gonna keep them small ones because they had quite a few big ones and uh, for seed potatoes. So we could keep some of them. I wonder if that's the seed potato. And use it for a seed potato. Let it start sprouting and use it next year. Yeah, we're gonna have to eat some most of them little potato for breakfast or something. The skin is just rubbing right on off. Well, you know, we are potato people, so that was gonna be a problem. That won't be a problem. You know me, I'll go in there and wash them up. Toss them in some Earl of choice. Toss some seasoning. Mm -hmm. I'm small talking. enough for you to toss them in some oil. And put them a in the sea salt. Mm -hmm. Put them in the oven, roast them. Or the air fryer. Or the air fryer, roast them. Mm -hmm. And good to go. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't cook with a lot of salt, but potatoes need some salt. Yeah. That they do. That soil looks rich. This is a mix. I um, started with potting soil. And then I did a mixture of topsoil, potting soil, and then that um, tomato and vegetable fertilizer. So actually, some of the new ones might have more potatoes because they probably, I think they got more fertilizer. That's my opinion. Uh-oh. Another potato. Oh, my. <laughs> All the people out. That looks like it might be. Is that the seed? Uh-uh. Or has it? Maybe, because I've seen pieces of this, and it looked papery. It was just one seed potato. Um, All of them have one potato on it, except for that bag, the new bag. That's had the last three or four. Might even be five see potatoes but they were so shriveled up I don't know if they had enough energy to produce but prayerfully they did they produce these but not uh, spuds but maybe not spuds I was watching in my gardener he was saying when you put a potato in warm soil they sprout fast but they don't they sprout up quick but they don't set roots so your potatoes not as big whereas if you do them in the springtime um, early spring where the soil is cool they'll dig roots to try to stabilize themselves mm -hmm. and then they start growing up so therefore you usually get a bigger super. That's how I understood it when he said it anyway. Oh I might have to do a voiceover y'all this music too loud because y'all know how you two do it. It could be a song I wrote and sang on and they yet and still won't you do you have the rights to this song? I'm singing it, ain't I? Anyway. Yeah, if those potatoes had gotten bigger. But I said, Lord, I said, if I get six potatoes per bag, I'll be happy. That's what I said. You got more than six out the first bag? I got huh? more than six. And you still um, pulling little taters out. I think it's in my potatoes in here. So did I ask you what you're going to do with the soil already? Mm. I'm going to amend it. And I have some um, seed tape with carrot seed, white radish, and beet. I think I'm going to grow them in these 10-gallon bags. So I'm just going to fill them up close to the top. Amend it and put that seed tape in there and bury it. I think the paper biodegrades and the seed tape as the seed takes root. So I'm gonna try that out because it seemed pretty cool. All right, y'all, that's the first bag of potatoes. We ain't gonna fill them on one because I ain't got enough room on this phone. Number two, we're gonna need them other two. We're gonna need them for like a week. Yeah, let's try a week. So next Saturday, I don't know, so this Saturday is busy. Next week, sometime, we're gonna pull them potatoes out the bag. <laughs> All right. 
Thank you all for watching my video. Like, comment, subscribe. Enjoy the view of my garden beds at night.